Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to download and install apps that are incompatible with your old iOS devices. And to do this, you'll be using an application called Tree U Tools. It's a application that is compatible with Windows PC so if you haven't downloaded this application before you can go ahead and download and install it I've already downloaded this application as you can see so after installing you open it and connect your iOS device using a USB cable to your computer and you will be prompted to sign into your Apple ID I'm gonna go ahead and connect but of course I've already signed in it's taking a little while to actually connect to the application okay so here we go so it has been connected and as you can see i'm using an iphone 5 so it's one of the old version it's iphone 5c and as you can see the last version that it had was 10.3.4 and most of the apps that are coming out lately they are version 12 and version 13 and 14 so that says that there's not much that this iPhone will be able to do for me if it is that I can't get all the latest apps on it so I found a workaround to actually get those apps on your device okay so if you're now signed in to your ID then what you would do is go to apps in the application and here's where you'd actually start downloading the apps but i'm gonna show you what i'm talking about i'm gonna demonstrate to you so i'm gonna actually allow you to see my screen go to the Apple Store and I'm gonna try to download Instagram okay so I'm gonna try to download this application okay so you see where it says this application requires iOS uh, 12 or later so it's basically telling me that the version that my phone has is incompatible with this application so it won't be downloading for me so what I'm gonna have to do is that I'm gonna have to use this this application on my computer to actually initiate the download so it can give me a version that was compatible with my phone okay so I'm gonna go back to where it says apps let me exit out of this. And I'm going to search for Instagram. Okay, so 
now I've gotten it up. So I'm gonna initiate the download from within this application, then go back over to my phone and try to download it. Okay. Mm. okay so I'm gonna show you my phone screen so you can see the changes. Okay, so now you can see a down arrow. So you can see a down arrow that I can click on. So instead of saying get, it is now a down arrow that is telling me that I can download this app. So I'm going to go ahead and click on it. Okay, so it's processing and it's saying, do you want to download the last compatible version? So I'm just going to go ahead and click on download. And as you see, it is now downloading. So guys, yeah, it's this easy to get apps that are not actually downloading to your old iOS device anymore. So whether it's iPhone 4 or 5 or iPads, you can try it this option and I guarantee you it will work so you don't need to actually log into other person's device to actually get apps anymore you can actually use this option and the apps even though it says that you can only get the version that was compatible with your device the apps will still update and move on to other versions and it will still work on your device Okay guys, so thank you for watching my channel, my name is Ray Johnson, and remember if you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up, and remember to subscribe, and click on that notification bell, because I'll be coming up with more videos just like this one, in fact my next video, I'll be showing you how you can actually get your Apple ID fast and easy and no there are persons out there that they have fear of getting an Apple ID because they believe that they will have to put in their card information in order to get an Apple ID but I'll show you a way that you don't have to do that so bye bye you take care